In today's video, we are here with Cool Greenville Gamer, which is my alt account, and we are testing the rear AEB feature that got added to the game recently. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, um, let's just get on to the first car. So, um, the cars are pretty much, there's like, there's like a lot, Hunter told me. So, uh, the Traverse at the higher end trims and the XJ higher trims, uh, have it, uh, the Teslas do. So yeah, we'll just have to figure it out. Yeah, without any further ado, we are going to get our first car, which, uh, we'll find, you know. So as you can see now, the limited cars are off sale. If you guys saw my last video, it's very unfortunate, but yeah. Anyways, we're going to get the higher turn 2023 traverses, um, just cause, you know, if I can find them. There they are. All right, we're obviously going to get the RS. Uh, I've been meaning to get this actually in white, so yeah, we're going to get. So yeah, anyway, I have my Alton here because we are going to do a few different tests. We're going to do it on a building, a prop car, a pedestrian, and another person's car. All different things. So let's see if it's the same for all of them. So we'll do a range of different tests. So yeah. All right. Hopping in this thing. Cold start. <laughs> so this starter was actually taken off of my in real life traverse. So rear AEB. Make sure it has it. Yep. All right. We're going to back up to a building first. So yeah, here we go. All right, let's back it up, see if anything happens. Uh, okay, nothing happened. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll try a prop car. All right, here we go. And nothing. Uh, okay, well, uh, here, we'll try a person. <laughs> uh, here we go. Ah, that's not good. <laughs> I guess we don't have rear AEV. That's kind of weird. Hunter told me that it was in the traverse. Well, anyway, let's get a different car then. All right, so we're going to go to the Teslas here. Uh, let's see. Uh, Celestial. Here we go. All right. We're going to buy a few Teslas here. So let's get this one right here. We will also get the Model S and the Model X. This is a lot of money. <laughs> All right, here we go. And boop. All right. All right. So we're going to try out this car again. Here, first of all, let's try out the Celesta truck real quick. See if there's any changes to this. I honestly feel like there's none, but there is AEV, so we'll see. All right, going up to the building. There we go. Okay, so it's there. All right, what about a prop car? Perfect. Yeah, we'll go a little faster this time, you know. Oh, well, that didn't work. One more time. We'll go a little slower this time. Nope, people in rear AEB like are just non-existent. All right, what about another person's car? All right, Cool Gamer Gamer has the Saturn. Let's back it up. Nope, nothing. So I don't even know if rear AEB actually works with this car and just like old, just like cars in general. I think it's only with props. So that's very interesting. I did not know that. So anyways, if you can't tell, this video is already going wrong. But uh, you know, we're just whatever. Okay. Uh, <laughs> So anyway, we're gonna get on to the next car. Uh, I believe we only tested the Celestra. So we'll do the Model X next. All right, here we go. So clearly, something we have learned in this test, it's actually pretty vital information. Um, if you're trying to back up a GBRP server and rely on AEB so you don't hit someone behind you, that does not work. So yeah, it only works with buildings. So yeah, we're going to go top speed members and actually test it with the building here. So here, here we go. We might not need this much of a run up. Oh, we're at 45. All right, here we go. And okay then, not that bad, honestly. Uh, we had quite a bit of leg room there. Uh, I don't know why I said leg room, but you know, leeway room, I guess you could say. So yeah, I'd say the Model X definitely passed the test. Um, we have a few more Teslas here to test out. S here, they're honestly probably gonna be the same, these ones, so yeah. <clears throat> Character as well, my alt, and okay. Uh, I mean, oh my gosh, I mean, kind of worked for sure. I don't know what my alt's doing over there. But yeah, that was the Model S. Um, did pretty decent as well. We already did the Truckla. Like, we already did the Truckla. Now we'll do the actual Model 3 here. Actually, this is a Model Y. My bad. I didn't buy a Model 3. I guess Truckla's our Model 3. So yeah, uh, first of all, something weird about AEB is that it doesn't work with objects in front, as you can probably tell. But with the rear, uh, oh, that was not that good. Uh, uh, ooh, ooh, this AEB is a little iffy. As you can see, oh, we're not getting much. We're, we're, the car's kind of told here. 
Uh, oof, that's not good. Uh, here, let's go back into the building. Let's see if that works. Oh, okay. Well, that works. Okay. Uh, I don't know what my alt's doing again. Okay, let's try Ejectify. Oh, okay. Ejectify's doing pretty good. What about the Traverse here? Okay, doing good. Um, okay, it's actually not doing that bad now. It was freaking struggling at first, like crazy. Um, oh, what the heck? Oh, there. So it's like, not that good with the pole. Okay. Huh. Well, overall, it's honestly really good. Um, honestly surprising this feature. Man. <laughs> it's actually not doing that bad, so it's good. Alright. Uh, ooh. <laughs> My alt is dead now. My alt went in the dealership! I hit it inside the dealership! Is he good? Oh, he's definitely not okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, anyway, there's some other cars that may have A, B in reverse as well. Hunter told me the higher trims are the traverses, but I did not see that. Here, maybe I should get the, the, the little bit of the older traverse, you know, the 2020? Uh, here it is. Alright. RS Premier Red Line, you should probably get, honestly. Or High Country, actually. Honestly, High Country is probably our best bet here. Um, yeah, high country. Alright, well, we'll get a high country. I want to get some black rims on it, though. That would look kind of sick. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's see if the high country has reverse AB or if it even has AB. <laughs> Alright, here's the reverse. I've actually never seen this mesh yet. Wow, I'm very impressed by this, actually. This is very impressive. So much better than before. Alright. Alright. Uh, let's see. It has AEB. Let's see if it works. Oh. <laughs> no, it, like, that's kind of weird. It doesn't work. Okay, well, I don't know what's with the traverses, but it just does not work in the traverses. It has AEB, like, you see the bottom there at the speedometer, but nothing. Literally, absolutely nothing. Like, we could do burnouts all day if I wanted to. It's not gonna let me, probably. Oh. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm getting sidetracked. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much a quick review on uh, the A rear AEB on some cars. Uh, I'm struggling to find any more cars with um, the rear AEB, and I also don't want to spend a fortune on some of these vehicles. So um, yeah. Uh, anyways, guys, uh, that's the end of this video here. Please comment below some r cars that actually have rear AEB, and I will try to do some testing with those maybe in a future video. But yeah, for now, this is it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.